Hello, I am here at Universal Studios Florida to test out a product we were given called Boost Oxygen. Now, for a lot of people going into the parks, they're saying they don't get enough oxygen because of their mask or that they're feeling lightheaded. Some people like the mask, some people don't like the masks. Well, these right here, these Boost Oxygen, they are meant for a lot of different reasons. It's really just to give extra supplemental oxygen. So one of the advertisements that they originally had was that you could use this if you were going hiking, if you're normally, you know, a lot lower uh, atmosphere, like if you're used to being in Florida and all of a sudden you go to Colorado and you're going hiking and you kind of need that extra oxygen. Now, the reason I've kept the mask on the whole time is because I wanted to make sure that I've had it on and I've been using it for a little bit. And so while we have done an article about the effects of masks while wearing them in the theme park, I'm going to link that above we wanted to see will these make a difference after wearing a mask for a little bit of time will one of these boost oxygens help being in a hot park it's about 88 degrees today and just see if it really you know a quick shot of oxygen is enough to make you kind of feel better now i knocked them all over but as you can see there's a couple of different versions this little tiny real small one all the way up to the huge can uh, i kept the plastic on because specifically what it says the oxygen is weightless this is a very very light can but they needed to put that on there because before i read that i specifically thought this thing feels like it's empty and they got a little advertisement on there to make sure you know a little warning it's okay we sent it full it's just air i mean that's that's what it is 95 percent pure air so i'm gonna open it and we're gonna try it out so I got it open. I'm gonna let you know I'm in the U rest area of Universal. This is an area specifically where you are allowed to take off your masks. They have a bunch of social distancing markers and there's usually not a ton of people in here. So it's very easy to stay apart from other people if you do have to take off a mask. Sometimes it's nice to go here literally just to get a drink of water and to take it off without having to worry. But I'm gonna take it off. And we're gonna try the biggest can first. It is the natural. We also have peppermint. So we'll have to see. It said, all you have to do, put it up to your mouth and well, it feels like air is spraying on you, which I mean, that's what it is. It, again, this is the natural one, so it's not supposed to have any flavor or anything. I'm obviously doing way more than they would even probably normal, normally recommend. Not that it's dangerous or anything, because again, it's oxygen, but more than you would probably need to do at once. It fits comfortably over your mouth, but... I'm not noticing a huge difference, but at the same time, I don't really get bothered by masks where I know other people can, and maybe it might be something that could affect them more. Might be able to help out more with getting that pure oxygen. I can say it is easier to take a deep breath with one of these, because of course, there's gonna be a ton of stuff going around in the air, more than just oxygen, and with this, you're getting 95%. So I will say you can take a deep breath a lot quicker. It's different. It's weird to just shoot oxygen into your mouth. It's like space balls, if you've ever seen the movie when they try to steal all the oxygen for the planet Druidia. Okay, well, we tried that one. It at least, if anything, I know that it made it easier to take a deep breath and maybe that's all you need. Sometimes you just need to be able to take a deep breath. So I've also got the little mini version here. I'll read the back real quick. It says, Oxygen directly fuels 90% of all body and mind functions. The average oxygen level in the air is 21%. Boost oxygen offers 95%. So, a significant increase. This is also the peppermint. Oh, it is peppermint. That one made a bigger difference, actually. I don't know if it's because it's the peppermint and you just think that it's working better, or if it actually is, but like, I feel like this one actually, hmm. The peppermint flavor is not crazy. It is a very, I mean, like, it tastes like you ate a mint like 10 minutes ago. But this one actually made a difference. Hmm, it feels weird to be. 
but it's just air, but hmm, okay. Well, I tried the big one and I didn't think it made a huge difference. I did say it made it easier to take a deep breath. This one I actually could, I could feel. So I've got the mid-size version and this is organic rosemary, a brain booster, all natural. So again, the first really big one, it was just the natural air and maybe that's what it was is just feeling the natural air didn't make it feel like a big difference. Uh, the peppermint one did. And now let's try this. Oh no. So this little piece on the medium sized one, for some reason, wasn't letting any air come out. I added this piece on from the large one and uh, I heard air come out. So we're gonna try it with this one then. Again, this is the medium sized. Hmm. Also a tiny, tiny little taste. You can feel that one too. So I didn't get a ton out of the natural one, the big one. And maybe it's just a little bit of flavoring. Again, if it makes your brain think that, that it's working, it doesn't really matter because as long as you feel different and you feel better, that's all that matters. So the natural one, I said it helped me take a, a bigger breath. This one with the rosemary, the uh, brain booster. You can kind of feel that one a little bit too. My favorite though is actually the little one, the little peppermint one. You know we live in a crazy world when you're reviewing oxygen at a theme park. It's just different, I don't know. It's not like I'm eating food where I can be like, oh, this texture. I also don't know, I assume with this kind, you technically breathe in like this, but you could lose some because the oxygen comes out at the bottom. Where this one, like you just put your mouth directly over it. So you kind of, it's guaranteed that you get all the oxygen straight into your mouth. Those two do make a difference. They do. Boost oxygen. So if you're gonna be in a park and for whatever reason, you know, you feel that you're either low on oxygen or you might want extra oxygen and you're able to just step to the side and use one of these real quick. I mean, this one's not, this is not big at all. You could easily, I mean, you could put any of them in a backpack. I mean, that's how, I got them here, but if you don't want to take this huge thing with you into the park, this is not bad. You know, take a couple with you on a trip if you wanted, you know, if you felt that that would help. And if it makes you feel better, it makes you feel better. I can say the medium and the small, I could, you know, it's not like, you know, you did something insane, but it is, it is where you can feel that you're, you are getting a very, very deep breath of oxygen and you kind of have that calm feeling, you know, if, if you were to take a lot of deep breaths and do almost like a breathing exercise or something like that. So boost oxygen. You might want to check it out next time you're heading to the park or hiking or a bunch of other things where you just might need more oxygen. <laughs>